press briefing combined the announcement of the Newport Beach Film Festival's birthday salute to John Wayne and the launch of the official JohnWayne.com website. The tribute to John Wayne will celebrate his 100th birthday and is the largest retrospective of John Wayne films ever presented. This is the eighth year for the Newport Beach Film Festival, which will showcase over 400 works in addition to the classic John Wayne movies. Making the event extra special, members of the Wayne's family were on hand to share stories about one of the most famous actors of all time. Newport Beach, California is where John Wayne spent most of his life, and the event was on the boat he previously owned, the Wild Goose. Wayne spent many happy years cruising from Mexico to Alaska on the 136-foot converted minesweeper. Uh, probably not all up today. What else can I tell you about it? Uh, uh, if you guys have any interest in, in products that come from Wayne Enterprises, thank you. Mom, uh, I almost forgot to make my mom like to compensate the blowers. I'm here just to say a few very few words. I want to tell you all that John Wayne was a great man. Measure not only in the true value of a man, by power, by life that would have never been the same without him. I miss him very much. And I will always know that my children have the finest father that God ever put on earth. Love you show for him. I'm deeply grateful. Thank you. Uh, but one of the people who will be participating uh, in several of the screenings in our symposium probably knew John Wayne as far as a co star better than any. He happened to star with the Duke in such things as The Quiet Man, The Searchers, The Alamo, and Big Jake. Uh, it's my honor to introduce to you John Wayne's son, Mr. Patrick. My sister Marisa is sitting right here in front, and my sister Melinda is in back in the first car. Part of the extended family. Uh, it's really it brings back a lot of memories being on the uh, the old Wild Goose. I remember spending a lot of time traveling around on her, spending time playing bridge with my stepmother Pilar and my dad. The, uh, the ship didn't look anything like this uh, when he had it. It was completely different, but it's finally built up big enough to hold his entire extended family. So <laughs> he really, he really did love this ship. Everybody's uh, talked about that. I had the privilege uh, of working uh, at that very early age and on into my uh, adulthood uh, with my dad in seven films, and uh, and I can tell you that I would rather spend time with him on here. And working with him, <laughs> he uh, he was all business when he was working. He, he was definitely professional, and uh, you might have described him as short-tempered. He, he wanted to get things done his way. But when he was on the ship, he was uh, very relaxed and full of good humor, and uh, and uh, always a pleasure to be around. Anyway, it's uh, it's amazing to me and my brothers and sisters that some 27 years after our, our father's passing, that he still has the celebrity and, and his ability that he does today. And uh, this film festival and all the excitement around it is really uh, a testament to that. And uh, we're really excited. We're really excited about this film festival coming up and anxious to take part in it. I was uh, fortunate enough to work on some of the films at the festival. And uh, maybe we get a chance to, to talk about some of those films uh, when they're played. We're down here in Los Angeles Scholarship. But originally, he wanted to go to uh, Annapolis, but he didn't have the political connections to go there. But, but, but he was a man driven to succeed. His success in films, and he got it in Annapolis, he probably would have been the head of John Jesus. 
staff. So when he didn't get that, he got a scholarship to SC. He was like free legal and he was very interested in politics. And he definitely would have been the president of the United States. And uh, so fortunately, he separated his shoulder and we had this great body of work that lives after him that we can all enjoy for years to come. <laughs> Like all events that bring together a large family, a group photo was needed. With four generations sitting down together on the old boat deck of the Wild Goose, where he used to keep his water ski boat, the scene would have made the Duke proud to see them all so happy. Okay, so the new John Wayne website, www.johnwayne.com, will have a wealth of information and offer memorabilia on the actor. Supporting independent filmmakers from around the world, the 8th Annual Newport Beach Film Festival is presenting a wide range of feature-length, documentary, short, and animated films. The works will compete for both jury awards and the coveted audience awards. This is Jerry Grant on The Wild Goose in Newport Beach with My Entertainment News. Mm -hmm.